All right, we are back with yet another Dragon Ball Z Dokkan battle video. And in this one, we're taking on stage three of the new Supreme Magnificent Battle, aka Blue Zone Magnificent, or uh, Blue Zone Movie Edition. And uh, in this one, we do have a special condition to clear, and that is the Exploding Rage category team. So we have to run a team of all Exploding Rage units. Now, luckily, Despite it seeming like a niche category, it's actually not that bad. Especially if you have a lot of the newer stuff. Or not a lot, but some of the newer stuff. Some of the stuff from last year as well. So the team we are running is we are using our AGL Super Saiyan Broly as our lead. Because he leads Super, boss, uh, super Bosses, Transformation Boost, and Full Power. Which are three very fun and very good categories. And then he, of course, 30% Exploding Rage, which is nice. And then Movie Bosses. So we're getting a full 200% team here, of course, all over the spectrum. Um, we have the Tech Broly, the Tech Zamasu, and the AGL Zamasu being led by uh, Super Bosses. And then we have the Beast Gohan being led by Full Power. And then the uh, Beast, or the Least... Gohan, LR Lee Gohan, uh, being led by the transformation boost, and then everyone is being led by Exploding Rage. So we're bringing him as a friend unit as well, a rainbowed copy nonetheless, and we got two Weeses and a Icarus support memory. So let's get right into this fight. I haven't done this yet, and I haven't even tried this team, but it sounds. Sorry about that, I accidentally ended the recording. I meant to say it sounds like a good team in theory, so we're going to get right into it. And I was trying to unmute the sound because, like I said in the last videos, Do Dokkan is playing copyrighted music. They're playing Chala, Chala Hechala in the, in the menus again. So, you know, I accidentally clicked the, the recording, the end recording button instead of the unmute button. Um, that's just my fault. But this fight does have three phases, so let me do my first rotation and then we can kind of talk about what's going to be happening here so this fight does have three phases the first fight is against a ur super agl super saiyan goku he has 75.9 million hp 400k attack 259k defense with 64 percent damage reduction his super attack raises attack for one turn and does 1 million damage and he can also, he his skill set is he has stun immunity, he nullifies super attack ceiling, and he disables attack and defense reduction. So it's not a very scary phase. Of course, it is the first phase of three, so it's not going to be the hardest thing in the world. He just has um, some pretty good defense. So you want to bring some stuff that's going to damage... Hopefully we can beat this first try. This obviously is not a bad team, um, with the exception of possibly physical ultimate Gohan. Uh, I don't think he's a bad unit, I just don't think he's up here with the rest of the team. But Broly is just going to be doing his thing, stacking here, and we're going to get that twice this turn. But of course we gotta float one of them off because we don't want, you know, we don't want him to be, you, we don't want two of them on the same turn, really. At least not until one of them transforms and they're then able to link together. Whole bunch of Broly animation here, though. Another one. We're just getting additionals left and right, which is good. That's a good thing. All right. So, fun thing about Tech, the new Carnival Tech Broly, he transforms. He can transform on appearance. We're also gonna want to float that Zamasu off, I think. Defense. Right. 
Yeah, let's go with this right here. Well, I don't know, actually. Let's do... No, let's do this. It is the- it's the first phase. As long as Gohan doesn't get super attacked, I think we should be okay. I did talk about this in the last video, but I want to kind of talk about it again just to reiterate it. The LR Gamma's finish effect is probably my favorite animation in this game. But second to that, this is also good uh, that he's supering the Broly. Um, second to that, not gonna lie, the <laughs> the new Broly and the new Golden Trilo, they probably have my favorite animations. They are just so cool. Broly literally did nothing. But yeah, we we need to get this Zamasu on rotation with Tech Zamasu. Let's do it like this, I think. Normally, I want I would want to keep Tech Zamasu on rotation, but with Beast and Broly, I don't want to float them off. Especially Beast. Let's hope we can kill before he hits Zamasu because Zamasu is very tanky, but I don't want to, I don't want him to get supered. Um, but I think as long as we get additionals with the Broly, we should be good here. Oh yeah, we're gonna be fine. And move on to phase two, which is going to be against a super tech. Uh, Super Saiyan Goku, Super Saiyan Vegeta, and Super Saiyan Trunks team. There we go. Now let's go ahead and pop this active, uh, because this active is a 26% buff to attack and defense for the Broly, and it sticks around for the entire, the entire match, which is very cool. We're gonna have Gohan take that single hit, just to reduce his chance of being super here. But, um, so this phase has, just like the last one, 75.9 million HP, but it has 500k attack and 318k defense with 66% damage reduction, so it's a bit stronger and has a bit more defense. Um, the super attack is 1.4 million, and then the skill set, he has stun immunity, and then with each turn passed, he gets 10% attack up to 100%, so you can super attack to this guy, and you can disable his attack and defense. Or uh, you can redu reduce them. But you just don't want to take too long on this phase because he does stack attack per... Um, per rotation. Broly should post supers this, this far into the fight. He should be fine taking these attacks. This just went crazy. But yeah, we have Guard. He should be fine if he gets supered, but he's not going to get supered. I wasn't even paying attention to as if uh, the super already happened or not, to be honest. We got a nice fusion here. And our Super Saiyan Broly can now transform and activate his domain expansion. 
Very, very cool. We're gonna be slot winning the Beast Gohan, though. And we're gonna be doing this. Perfect. This is good. Super attack the Beast Gohan. That's what we want. Although I'm sure the Broly at this point with, you know, Domain and being transformed probably be fine. But better on Beast Gohan, just in case. Alright, let's let's see some damage probably. Nice. Some big damage. That was like a bar and a half. Let's see some more. Nice. 10 million crit. Let's see some more. Nice, 10.4 mil crit. Let's see some more, Broly. Keep it going. Oh my gosh. Another... Dude, Broly... <laughs> once he transforms, he's just so good, man. There is no stopping him. Absolutely insane. So, we're moving on to phase 3 of the fight, which is against Super Int LR Super Saiyan Goku. We're gonna go ahead and pop this active, just to get a little damage in. <laughs> Very pitiful for an active like that. We're also going to use a Whis specifically for fucking Gohan. Um, luckily, there's only one attack in the third slot. So, he should be okay. Um, especially with a Whis active. But, this Super Saiyan Goku has 95.5, or 99.9 .9 million HP, 590k attack, 590k defense with 68% damage reduction. His super attack greatly raises his defense for the turn, and it does 1.65 million damage. And his skill set has some more to it, so he is immune to, he is immune to stunning, he can nullify super attack ceiling and he disables defense reduction. He also reduces damage below a certain amount to zero. I don't know exactly what that number is. I assume it's 1 million. Um, because we just did a 2.8 million and it, it went through. So I think it might be 1 million. Again, I don't know exactly. Um, and then he gets defense plus 6% with each attack received. So the more you hit him, the more defense he's going to be gaining. So again, you want powerhouse units. Now, what we're going to do is we are going to use Beast Gohan's active to lock everything onto him. And he's going to take all of these attacks because one, he's Beast Gohan. Two, he has active skill buffing. And three, there's still a Whis active. Um, and he's about to get some red orbs. So... He's going to take all those attacks and he's going to beef up like crazy. We will probably be ending this Goku's life this turn because, you know, we got both of our Brolies with the domain active and we're going to have a crazy buffed up beast. Yep. So let's... This shouldn't do shit. This should do nothing. I don't think it would... I think it wouldn't even do anything on Beast, even if we didn't have a Whis active, just because it's Beast fucking Gohan. But, you know, even with the Whis active... Crazy, dude. He, he is just so good. Him and the new um, Tech Broly are, like, contenders for number one. I know some people are saying that the new Tech Broly is number one. I think it's really, I think they're really close. I think you could say either one of them is number one, because just that's how close they are in terms of power. But what's crazy is they can be both two, he, they can be ran on the same team with both getting 200% lead under the HEL Broly, which to me 
that is absolutely insane. That number one and number two get led on a team with other top ten. We don't even need Beast Gohan, man. We don't even need him. That's just how crazy this team is. This attack's gonna kill. We didn't even need the Beast Gohan, and that was gonna do a lot of damage, man. But yeah, that's it for the video. This was uh, Blue Zone Movie Edition Stage 3. Uh, clear mission, but also the Exploding Rage clear mission. Uh, first try as well, so not too bad. I hope they add some more stages and missions for this here soon, because uh, it'd be very nice to get some more free stones but that's gonna be it for the video i'll see you guys in the next one peace